What's up everybody? My name is Jordan and this is my channel J's for Days. If you're stopping by, it's time to get high. Let's go. Alright guys, so today's episode is going to be our first ever product review here on J's for Days. Um, I am not sponsored by this brand. However, I will have an affiliate link in the description below. If you fall in love with this product, you want to cop yourself one, click my link in the description below and cop yourself one. But uh, yeah, if you haven't uh, guessed already by my shirt, we're going to be doing a Luca product today. It is going to be the Dragon Egg. That's right, guys. The Luca Dragon Egg. I'm really excited for this one. Uh, it's one of Luca's newer products. It's been out for a minute, but one of their newer ones. I've uh, been really excited to try this. I haven't tried it yet, guys. Uh, I unboxed it just so that I could charge it to make sure it had enough battery for this episode for you guys. It actually already had a full charge on it, which was really cool. Um, I haven't seen, you know, usually you get those electronics in and it'll have like a partial charge on it or it'll need to be charged or whatever. This came fully charged for me. So that was really great. Uh, but anyways, let's get right into it, guys. The Dragon Egg. Here we go. All right, here we go, guys. Here is the Luca Dragon Egg. I actually went for the red color myself. Um, there's a bunch of other colors out there. But uh, yeah, let's open this guy up and see what we got. Really nice box here. This guy slides right off. We got our user manual right here. Okay. A little foam protecty guy right here. And here it is, you guys. Here is the dragon egg. Okay, so we're going to carefully take this out. I'm going to try to do it while I'm looking upside down so I can show you guys. But here it is. Okay, this guy gets turned around just like that. Boom. This is the device. All right, you guys. So um, it works pretty much the same way most Luca products do as far as the buttons go. So we just have one button on the side here. Uh, it's going to be five clicks to turn on, five clicks to turn off, right? So one, two, three, four, five. That turns it on. Gives you a little countdown with a little, ooh, a cool little light show in there. That's cool. Okay, so it says it's ready. Now, two clicks to um, two clicks to move through the different temperature settings. So that brings it to level two. That brings it to level three. And you click it twice, goes back to level one. Right. So, um, unlike the Q7 guys, you're not going to be able to put your exact temperature in this, but this does have a high, medium and low. So, um, how you, uh, we'll get into the, the function of this guy a little bit more, but, um, so this guy right here opens up just like that. Okay. It comes with a is it a quartz bucket or a ceramic bucket? It is, do, 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 do. sorry guys, I just wanna get this right for you. Oh, this cool, this is cool, it comes with a little warranty and a certification card here. But, place multiple coils. <clears throat> All right guys, so, um, this does come with a quartz bucket in here. Uh, also quartz and ceramic buckets are just going to taste better. I mean, I don't think there's much opinion to that. I definitely think you're going to get more taste and flavor out of it. Um, but this guy is really cool, right? Inhale through here. Okay, cool. So what we got to do now, guys, in order to use it is we got to put water in it. So we're going to unscrew this bottom piece here 
and I'm not 100% sure how much water to put in it because it's my first time, but let's give it a go. All right, we got some good bubbly action. All right guys, so <clears throat> we got our water in, our bucket is ready to go. Let's load it up. Got some dabs here. We'll take a little bit. A little dabby there. Hopefully you guys can see that. I know I always put my, my hand in front of it before and my hand is just so pale white you guys still can't even see it. But hopefully you guys can see that little dabber that we got on there. So. We're just gonna go right into the um, into the bucket here. We're gonna be doing a cold start with this guy. This guy is made to do cold starts, right? Um, I'm sure you could probably do a hot start with it, like as it starts heating up. Um, but uh, I just do cold starts, like they're built for that, so. All right, so I think you have to press and hold the button. Let's just see here. Ooh. Oh my God, you guys, that is so good. That was a really nice cloud. I didn't like cough at all. Damn, let's hit that some more. Damn, it's still ripping. It's got this little carb guy on the top <coughs> you can play with. <coughs> Damn. Cool thing about this guy is <coughs> you can just kind of hit it whenever you feel like. You just push the button and it's heating up. So yeah, apparently those 10 seconds that it did when uh, when I first turned it on, that's like a preheat. It, it like preheats itself. <coughs> and then you just... Okay, so it says that I can do this uh, press and hold thing for up to 30 seconds. I can't believe this is still hitting you guys. Wow, guys, I gotta say, I'm really impressed uh, by this little guy, but, but honestly, that was way, way better than anything I could have expected. Um, I, I didn't think it was gonna like hit that hard. Um, I don't know how you how it looks for you guys on camera, but that thing just kept ripping and ripping and ripping. Really, really cool. Um, I'm gonna take a little alcohol to this guy's, clean it up. I always clean all my stuff after every hit. You guys will get to know that about me. I just, I try to do it as clean as possible all the time. I'm trying to encourage you guys to do the same. It's healthier and it just tastes better. Your stone is better. It's just better. Wow. Guys, <clears throat> I highly recommend you go down in the description and hit that affiliate link that I have and copy yourself one of these, maybe for a Christmas present or for somebody. Um, this is, this is phenomenal. Uh, let's do that again. <laughs> I really enjoyed that, guys. Um, that was really cool. I'm gonna give it a sniff test to make sure there's no alcohol. Okay, good. That's the best way, guys. And also, you could always, like, see, I could hit the little heating element there. That's gonna burn off any excess whatever. But that was on the first setting. So... 
All right, guys, what do you say? Let's, uh, let's turn it up to number two. All right, we are now in setting two. And we're gonna load this bad boy up again. I don't know if you guys can see that. Hopefully you can. But just a nice little bucket in there. Really, really nice. Let's get some of this stuff out of the way here. All right, guys, we are on setting two now. So this is the uh, medium voltage. We loaded up a, a new dab. Let's give it a try. Yo, this rips. Yo, this rips. Just another reason that I'm absolutely in love with, with the brand Luca, you guys. Um, I haven't really found a product of theirs that I don't like. I have their Q7, which, you know, at the moment is my absolute favorite, but this is goddamn. My Q7, which was like my, um, my first ever Luca product. And that thing has just been phenomenal for me. I think I've had it for like three years or something like that. And that thing just continues to rip and rip and rip. I love that Q7. Um, I can put it into any of my bones, my rigs. It's so cool, it's so much fun. Uh, I've also got the, the Seahorse, which is like um, a nectar collector version. Um, if you guys don't know what nectar collectors are, we may have to, uh, do a video on that one of these days, but this is phenomenal. I, I will say, um, on the, on the second setting, it definitely, I consumed it quicker like a, not as many hits uh but i will say those were bigger hits so that was really cool um but almost no coughing i think i had like one or two little coughs but like it's so smooth it tastes so good oh i love it all right guys so before we go to the next temperature setting i just want to say like i know the last video that I did with the dabs. Um, it's a lot to do with like the torches and the timers and be careful of burning yourself and all this and that. It's a lot, it's a lot of like sciencey shit. Um, not everybody's about that, I get it. This is a phenomenal alternative and look at how portable it is, I mean, I'm, I'm, <clears throat> I'm imagining taking this fishing, ice fishing, on hikes to the top of a mountain, you know, to your favorite hotel if you're in a, a, a legal state. Um, it, this thing is just so little and portable, I mean, and this, oh my god, this just comes right out. It seems to be easy to clean. I mean, this guy pops off. This coil right here screws right out. I already tried it. Um, as far as charging goes, it doesn't come with a charger, but it is a type C charger. So, you know, most of us have those type C's nowadays, especially if you have uh, Android. So, um, <laughs> Sorry guys, my energy's down a little bit. I'm fucking stoned. That shit got me good. Woo! Alright, let's wake up. <clears throat> wake up, wake up. 
I'm really loving this, uh, really loving this dragon egg, guys. I've, I've been seeing it advertised for a minute, and I was drooling over it a little bit, you know, because I'm a big Luca fanboy, and for good reason. I mean, they just make awesome products at, like, a really good price point, too. You know what I mean? I think this is, I think it's somewhere, I think it's in the $100-ish range category don't uh d don't quote me on the exact price but i think it's in that about a hundred dollars uh mark which guys for what we are getting damn all right guys so in order to thoroughly test this we have got to put it up to the uh the third the the third uh <laughs> I'm fucking stoned, sorry guys. We gotta put it up to the third temperature setting just because we have to, you know what I mean? We have to thoroughly test it. We're gonna get some more dabs here. Try to show it to you guys. Hopefully you can see it. This is a little uh, grape pie crumble that I have. Really been enjoying it. It's a nice, like, body high, like a good indica. You know what I mean? Like, just head to toe euphoria. It, it's a really nice strain. But, now, cook it to the third temperature setting, okay? All right, guys, let's see what this puppy is about. We're going on the hottest setting, temperature number three, Luca Dragon Egg, here we go. Wow. That, <clears throat> that was hard hitting. Um, damn. Guys. That first rip that I took, I just, I kept pulling and kept pulling and kept pulling because it was so smooth. I'm like, I'm like, maybe it needs a second to like warm up or something. Like, I was just trying to, you know, get a good rip and everything, and I just kept pulling, kept pulling. By the time I exhaled, I started seeing this monster fucking cloud come out, and it was strange, because it was actually, like, hot for me going out. Like, it wasn't hot going in, but going out, I was like, Whoa, you know what I mean? <coughs> and let me tell you what, I felt like I was a fire breathing dragon on that one. Holy shit. Let's fucking go, dragon egg. Um I love this thing. But uh <whistles> Damn. That one was a lot. That one was intense. Um, all right, guys. So let's let's talk about uh, those three different temperature settings that we just did right there. 
Uh, for me personally, I'm trying to decide if I like level one or level two more. I'll be honest with you, level three was was a little bit hot for me. It wasn't like, it wasn't too much. Like, I coughed some, but I wasn't like hawking up a lung or anything. It was just like, damn, that thing punched me hard. But <coughs> um, I feel like for me, and maybe it's just the dabs that I had, but I feel like it may be level one and level two just kind of burn those dabs a little bit better. Um, level one, I feel like I just could have kept hitting that thing for another half hour. You know what I mean? Just kept hitting, kept hitting, kept hitting. Um, so in my mind, that tells me that that's probably like heating it the most even, evenly. Now remember, everybody's dabs are going to require a different temperature. You're going to have dabs vary. You're going to have different consistencies, different potencies, different level. You know what I mean? Dip each dab is going to have a different temperature that will optimize that dab. Um, but I, I think Luca's got it perfectly covered as far as the, uh, the high, medium, and low spectrum. Um, the medium and the low... I, probably the medium was my favorite just because it gives you... A little bit harder hit than the than the low one, but still kind of goes for quite a while. Um, but that that first one was just was really good too. It really was. It you know it. I will say probably I prefer the second over the first, but it's it's by a, a small amount, not much. I could see myself probably using it on level one more often just to um, get more hits out of it. <clears throat> Damn, is my energy going down low again? Fuck, I am stoned as shit. Um, but yeah, I could see myself probably using level one. I don't know. We'll see, maybe I'll, maybe I'll give you guys an update on this thing in like a month or so. Um, but my thoughts on this, guys, Luca did a great job with the, uh, the different temperatures um usually high those high medium and lows i feel like they're just guessing um to me it looks like they actually did a little bit of r&d on this and really honed in some good temperatures um i really enjoyed the low and i think that high was was nice it wasn't too high you know what i mean <coughs> that can that can ruin it a lot of times is, that dad be or that temperature being too high um it's small super portable it's sturdy you know what i mean like it doesn't it doesn't it's not about to like tip over um even if it did this is some like hard plastic like it's not glass it's not gonna break i mean you know within reason but uh, really sturdy little unit here. I'm in love with it, guys. I really am. I'm, I'm so happy that I picked one up. You guys should definitely cop yourself one. Go down in the description below. Click my affiliate link. And uh, get yourself a dragon egg. And check out some of the other Luca products that they have there, too. Um, you won't be disappointed. They're, Luca just makes a really great product at a super fair price point, in my opinion. So, uh, yeah, I would say anybody who wants to do some dabs on the go, somebody who wants to do dabs that doesn't want to mess with the torches and burning themselves and things like that, um, I'd highly recommend the Dragon Egg, guys. I really would. Um, I'm gonna have a lot of fun with this. Uh, as far as cleaning it goes, it doesn't matter what you get, guys. I don't care what rig you get, what device you use to do your dabs. You need to keep up on the cleaning on everything. You got to clean all your stuff. That's just, that's part of the bit. Part of, I think that's why I have my Luca Q7 for, 
I, I think it is three years. I really clean it after every hit, guys. I really do. Um, I think it's going to enhance the longevity of your uh, of your babies here. But what do I know? I'm just a guy. I'm just some guy. But yeah, there it is, guys. The Luca Dragon Egg. Man, that one was a lot of fun. If you guys, uh, if you guys like this product review and you want to see more, comment down below what you guys want to see me review next. Let me know. Might see it on the channel. Look at that. Still, so basically, has like full battery too. Those little bars going around the number of the battery. Yeah, pretty cool. <clears throat> Dragon Egg, baby! Alright, you guys. What'd you think of the Dragon Egg? Pretty cool, right? I can, I can tell that's definitely going to be my buddy for a while. Um, <clears throat> but, if you guys have made it this far through the video, please throw me a like. Drop me a comment. Please subscribe, you know, hit that notification bell. We are going to be dropping videos every week. Um, I might be doing another product review too, uh, hopefully soon. And yeah, this is a lot of fun, guys. This is, this is why I'm doing it. You know what I mean? Just my love for weed um, and, and just seeing where it all goes, seeing what happens. You know what I mean? It's just, it's too much fun. Why not? All right, you guys, I'm super baked, so that means that's it for this one, you guys. Uh, that was a lot of fun, but until next time, peace out.